Today we're looking at 10 different websites that you can use to make money online for free. So what can you expect from this video? Well, I'm going to share these websites and as I've mentioned, they're all free to get started with. Most of these websites are available worldwide. Now what I like about these is you can work whenever you want with these. So you're not nailed down to a specific day or a specific time when you've got to do the work. And I've tried to include something for everyone. So if you don't like one of the websites that we look at, just wait for the next one because we cover a lot of categories and different niches. So I've, like I mentioned, I've tried to include something for everyone within this video. What do you not need? Well, you don't need any experience, you don't need skills, you don't have to spend lots of time on this, and more importantly, you don't even need to spend any money with this. So if you're looking for a genuine way to make some extra money online and from home without having to lay out a penny of your own money, then we will be covering many options in this video for you. So let's jump into today's video and I'll show you different websites that you can use to make money online. And I'm also going to share with you examples and my own earnings from two of the different websites that we're going to be covering today but before all of that if you like simple ways to make money online and work from home then subscribe to the channel and hit notifications and then you'll always know when i've uploaded a new video and if you want some free resources to make money online come over to my blog and check out my free members area all of the things that you see on the screen right now they're all absolutely free and waiting for you Hello, it's Mark from Not Taught at School and welcome to today. So let's jump in right at the beginning and we're going to start over here on Facebook. And don't worry, I'm not recommending that you go on Facebook and start spamming all your friends. The first method that we're going to look at and the first website that you can use is this one over here and it's called Teespring. And we'll go and look at this and how this all works. But this here is a service and it's known as Print On Demand. And how this works is, let me go over to Teespring so you can see this. So this website here is absolutely free to get started with. You see, commerce, not complicated. Teespring is a free end-to-end -end solution for your e-commerce business, create and sell online. So how does it work? Well, basically, if I scroll down here, let me just come down here, you can see all of these different designs on here. And I mean, I say designs very loosely. I mean, this is a design. People are creating designs which are then uploaded onto Teespring and those designs can be put onto t-shirts, mugs, hats, baseball caps, handbags, pillowcases and lots more. And then every time one of these products sells, the person who uploaded the design, they earn a percentage of the total sale. So you can go through and have a look at some of these designs on here and get some sort of ideas. If you scroll down to the bottom of this page here, there's a video here and it walks you through with this. But you can see here, Teespring is a free and easy way to bring your ideas to life. So if I come over here, let me just go and show you this. So if we go to the top here, you can go into any of these different sections here. You've got home decor, socks, phone cases, accessories, mugs. So you can go in and have a look at any of these. But I'm just going to take you into this animal lover. And then I'll go back to my Facebook page and show you this here. So you see these here. And this one these designs here this is how it works people are literally coming over to teespring uploading a design and then you depict what you want to sell it on whether you want to sell it on a t-shirt a jumper a hoodie etc so if we come down here on the left hand side we're going to go to trending collection so you can go on this website here and have a look at what designs are trending so these are currently the trending designs so you see this here where where is the sea with a laughing face and we've got some more on here and you might be thinking well that's, i don't understand it these i mean look at this here lots of people are going ahead and purchasing these products so to break it down you create create a design you come over to teespring you upload that design like this and you decide what you want to sell it on whether it's a t-shirt or any of your items so how do you go and get some you know some of these really simple designs well use this website over here and it's free and it's called Canva and you can create any design on here that you want so if we come here look let's just go on the left hand side so create an account for free on Canva we're going to go to templates down here let's just pick a template and I'll show you how quick and simple this really is to go ahead and do this so if we come down here 
Instagram stories, posts, Facebook covers, flyers, presentations. No one else. Let's go and look at brochures. Let's go with a logo for the time being. So let me just click on use this template. So this here would be your template for your design that you would upload over onto Teespring. So on the left hand side you've got all of these different options here. So first of all let's go into elements. And I'm going to click on laughing. There is our laughing face, so let me make that smaller. Let me get rid of this by clicking the bin delete element. And let me get rid of that as well. Delete. Let me take this, make this bigger like so, drag it down. So go back over to Teespring, sorry. Where is the C? Let's go over here. So on the left hand side, we're going to go to text, add a heading. And drag this up here. Where is the C? Okay, you see up here where it says font, you can change this to whatever you want on here. So if you didn't like this text here, you could go to this one here. You could make this bigger if you wanted, you could make it smaller. So basically, this piece of software is absolutely free. You create your designs on here. Once you're happy with these, you see up here where it says download. You click on download. Then you've got your design here. You go back over to this website here, this Teespring. You upload your design, and it's and then you'd like I say you mention you, you select what sort of clothing or item you want to sell it on. And then that is your listing, and it will go live on Teespring. So that is the easy part. This is the ridiculously easy part to print on demand. The issue, what many people have, is now you've got that design and you want to start driving traffic to that, how do you do this? Well, if we go back over here, I'm going to share an actual example with you. So this was a page that I created back in, <laughs> it was a long time ago, I think it was like 2015, oh yeah, two, uh, look, 2015. So what I did here is on this page, I shared images of cats, scroll down here, look at like videos and other bits on the page and then people obviously like comment and share and then what I would do is I would include one of these designs every two or three days and we had some we didn't earn a hell of a lot of money from this because we, we didn't focus on it too much to be honest with you it was just like a little side hustle we had going because we had many of these different pages over on Facebook so this was one of them so you see here love this please share this and let's sh sh what's this say sorry please share this and let's share the love this Christmas it ends in five days so once you've got come back over here once you've created one of these designs you can set how long it's you know the campaigns running for from memory I think you can select 7 10 or I think it was 30 days but look I haven't done this in a couple of years but this is one website that you can use it's really simple but what I would say is if you are going to go down this route here try and be a hell of a lot more specific within your niche because this here this wheel of our cats it's a very broad niche in it you know cats so try and go for a particular breed of animal or anything like that if we go back over here if we're going to let's go and have another look at let's just go into dogs this is a popular one If I scroll down here, come through and have a look at some of these, and you'll, you'll find so many of these different ideas on here. German Shepherd, I remember, I remember this was a popular one. If I go back up here, but you can see how incredibly simple. I mean, look at this here, dog ass. That's a design that someone's uploaded, and there's many more of these on here. So, what I would say is, if you are going to go down this route here, is just type in German Shepherd. What's that one? So there's only one listing for German Shepherds on here. If I click on here, how much will this cost us? No, it's not available, that one. It's already expired. So let's go and look at this one here French Bulldog Edition. Let's click on this one. 
So this one here on a standard t-shirt costs £24. I'm in the UK, £24.50. A mug is £17. And then we've also got a portrait here that's £5.74. And you see here this is the time of, available until tomorrow. And then you've got lots more different designs down here. So if I click on this one, let's just go and look how much this is selling for. Yeah, similar prices. <coughs> Excuse me. So this is how it works. So you decide on a niche. You then, once you've done that, you go over into your free software, which is called Canva. And you can create your images and logos and designs on here. And as you've seen already, some of these, you don't even have to have images on here. You can just use text. So that is one website that you can use. It's absolutely free to get started with. The easy part is setting it up and creating your designs. The hard part will be driving the traffic. Now, there's a number of ways that you can do this. You can go with the example here, what I've shared over on Facebook, where you create a page and start sharing content, and then you put your links in on here. You could do paid ads. You could do this on Instagram, Pinterest, Cora, and many more other platforms to drive traffic over to this here. One last thing over on Teespring. See here, how does it work? Come here and I'll show you this. So all of the, the designs are created by everyday people like you. There are absolutely no restrictions to who can use this site. There is no fee to design and sell while using Teespring. So that means basically you don't have to worry about any ongoing costs or anything. Your cost will be your time to upload your designs onto Teespring and then focus on driving the traffic. So this is just one website, it's called Teespring. There's another one that you can use which is starting to become a lot more popular and it's called Redbubble. So you can go over here and have a look at this one as well. The great thing about this website here, this Redbubble, is it gets a lot of organic traffic over here as well. So instead of you just having to focus on driving traffic, this website does get a lot of traffic as well. So you could potentially get some sales organically from this website here. But the whole process is exactly the same. You upload designs and then you pick what piece of clothing or, you know, accessories or <laughs> handbags or whatever that you want to sell on. But you'll see as you go through these, they're all really simple to do. And, and again, the process is here. Let's scroll, scroll up here. An artist creates the design and uploads it. You find a product feature in that design. The product is, re is responsibly produced and shipped and you get an awesome thing and the artist gets paid. That's pretty much how it works. So let me come out of here. But it's look, it's a free model. It's available worldwide and anybody can do this. So that is the first couple of different options for you. It is print on demand services. So let me come out of this Facebook page here. Let me come out with Teespring and this one here. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, the next website I'm going to share with you is another one which I currently, well, I don't currently do this, but I did the work once and I'm bringing, earning a passive income from this. This is over on a website called Skillshare. Now, over on Skillshare, what happens is people create online courses and they upload them. Now, don't let that put you off, and I'll walk you through this whole process here. But you can see this is my profile. If I come down here, you can see I'm currently teaching three different classes over on Skillshare. Now, all of these classes here, they, they were uploaded about a year, a year and a half ago. Now, let me show you this. Scroll down here, you can see my earnings from the platform here. Now, the earnings, they're not huge, but bear in mind, I have not touched anything on this website for probably, it's probably longer than a year, about 15, 16 months to be honest with you. And you can see here, if I scroll up to the top, so total earned and royalties here. So in March, I earned $54. If I scroll down here, in February, 40 January 60, December 80, 58, 60. But the great thing about all this is all of this income here, it's all passive because it all come from a course that I created and I uploaded onto Skillshare. Now, in terms of Skillshare and different courses that you can upload, look, don't, please don't let it put you off because let me show you like an example. So if, you, if someone's looking to learn sort of something really simple like so, how to make coffee look at this here 
how to make coffee and coffee drinks at home. So this course has had 270 students. It's 17 minutes long. This one here is a 12 minute course. This is about, well, making coffee so But if we go into this one here, look how to make coffee. 17 minutes. Come down here and click on this one. Now you've got, you've got to upgrade to premium. If I click on this one here, this is the intro to this course. We're going to be going over, be going over coffee, all the, coffee, all the basics, basics, what the different roasts mean, the different grinds, and a ton of different ways that you can make it at home. So you see this here, this video course, there's no flashy editing or anything like that. You can record these courses with your phone and upload them onto Skillshare. This is just one example. This is, you know, looking at coffee. But if you're going to browse here, go through and have a look at any of this. So let's just go on to, just click on lifestyle. What courses can you find over on lifestyle? What, what was that one? Cocktail secrets, how to make cocktails, creative tips for interior design, American sign language, sustainable living basics, 48 minutes. So you see these courses on here, they don't have to, I mean, this one here is three hours long, but you don't have to create courses that are really long. Learn to play the guitar. So look, if you have a skill or you're particularly good at something, look at creating a course. And you can do this just using your iPhone or you know whatever phone you're using. And then you can use sites like Skillshare to upload the content. And look, if you put in the time and the effort with this, you can earn some pretty decent money. I, <laughs> I haven't put in the time and the effort with this. These courses here, I uploaded them onto Skillshare because I'd already created them. I had them on other platforms and Skillshare is not just it's another place where I thought I'll put my courses up on there. It'll bring me in some additional income. And as you saw a second ago, oh, I've closed the tab, sorry. As you saw a second ago, it brings me in a passive income every single month. So anywhere between $30 and $50, but I did the work once. It brings me in a passive income. But Skillshare isn't the only website that you can use for this. There's many more. There is bit degree udemy and honestly there's hundreds more of these but you could look honestly let's let's try another one let's do um dog training for example look 38 minutes jesus that's, that's six hours that one 47 minutes so just go on the on the on the search bar up here. Anything you're particularly good at. If you're good at spreadsheets, Microsoft Excel or Word or Google Drive. Let me type in Google, see if there's anything on Google. Say look, even Canva, look, Canva for entrepreneurs, design a Google Plus photo. So if someone's created a course, how to design. A Google Plus photo using Canva. It's a 27 minute course, and all they will be doing is recording that. Let's have a look if we can show you this. They'll just be recording their screen. Look at this one, two, three, four. It's five videos, five videos long. In this lesson, we're going to be so he's just talking to the camera. That's video one, video two. Five videos, and it will be bringing in this guy, this Jeremy here, an online uh, an online passive income from this for doing the work once. <coughs> Excuse me. So that is the second website for you. It's called Skillshare. You can go ahead and find many more of these, but create an online course. It's a really simple way to make some extra money online. The next website I've got for you is this one over here, and it's called Shutterstock. Now, the reason we're looking at this one here is you can earn money from your photos and your videos because lots of people, bloggers, YouTubers, entrepreneurs, business owners, they're always looking for stock footage. Now, I've bought footage from Shutterstock many times for over on my blog and different YouTube channels. But how, how does it work? So on here, you come over to Sh um, Shutterstock. There's a link down below for you. And what you can do is you upload your images and your videos. You submit them over onto the platform. And then basically you get paid every time your content is downloaded by someone who uses Shutterstock. And Shutterstock is it's linked to, from memory, I think it's about six of the different websites that all link into them. So essentially, your photo or video that you upload, it's not just on one platform, it's on many. 
and every every time somebody downloads your picture you earn a commission for doing so so you can come over to this website here and you simply scroll all the way down to the bottom and you click on join now and you just fill in this form here and you go through this and then you start uploading your um, images and your videos over onto Shutterstock. If you scroll up to the top, there's, I believe, Support Center. If you go into the Support Center, you can find many questions about, you know, the process, how it looks, the, the getting started. So how to sign up, ID verification, your first upload, payment process, royalty rates and earnings. If you click on here, <laughs> that's a good answer, isn't it? How much will I be paid as a contributor? And depend on the type of license used. So you can go through here, go through the frequently asked questions and have a look at this. But this is another way how you can earn money online for free. It's uploading your photos and videos and essentially start earning a passive income like we looked at in the last on, on the last website. It's another way that you can start earning some extra money. The next website I'm going to share with you is this one over here and it's called respondent.io now this website here is absolutely free to get started with the company have been around for a number of years if I scroll down here how it works da, 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 da. these are some of the companies who respondent have worked with you can see Airbnb Microsoft SendGrid Dropbox lots of these so how does this work well these companies here and many more they may have a new website or a new design or a new product coming out and they want to get feedback from people before it launches on the marketplace. So they will come over to Respondent and they will pay Respondent a fee for sending them people to participate in their online surveys or their questionnaires or basically just trying to get some feedback from you and you will be paid pretty decent for doing so. <coughs> so if you come over to Respondent and you click on Get Started, you go through filling your name and your email and your other bits and then you will get access to the back office which looks like this so in my back office at this moment in time you can see there's currently 439 projects available on the left hand side it will tell you information about this so this here is a research study for, for professionals you will earn $90 for taking part in this study here yeah, and it'll last 10 minutes so you'll earn $90 for 10 minutes work if I come down here what's this one 60 minutes work you'll earn $75 now you don't want to sit and go through 439 you know of the of these different tabs if you click on load more here scroll down it will show you more but you can see look 10 minute work $90 research another research study come down here 60 minutes $100 60 minutes $50 etc on the left hand side you can click on in person and remote so click on remote it's now brought up 395 projects so you just go through and have a look at this but look it's absolutely free to sign up all you do is put in your details be open and be honest don't lie <laughs> because if you get sent if you get um, invited to a study group and you know you've got no experience or knowledge about it because you've lied you're not going to get paid so you'll be wasting your time and th the companies who are involved with this but this is another way that you can earn some pretty decent money as you can see 60, 60 minutes for $120 it's not bad going is it so that is another website for you it's called respondent.io again there will be a link down below for you the last one I'm going to share with you is this one over here and it's basically a website that you can use to sell your old phones so it's eco ATM and that's it basically so you come over to this website here and how it works is you place your device and oh no, you don't do that sorry I'm lying to you this is if you're going to sell this so the first part is you sign up once you've signed up you click on sell an item and then you put in your you know the phone model and all of the information about this and then they will give you a price for this and if you agree to sell it you'll get paid instantly so there's hundreds more of these different websites here so this is called ecoatm.com but look you see quick payments no salesperson no fine print no work so visit an eco ATM machine near you and get paid on the spot for your for your firm
so there, really, really simple stuff. I mean, this is going to be look. This is a one-time thing, and I've only I've thrown this in as just like an additional thing because every, everyone's got old phones in the drawers and the cupboards, aren't they? That they don't use anymore. So that's today's video. I hope you found it useful. That is some different websites that you can use to make money online and from home. Out of all of them, which one would I recommend the most? Personally, in my opinion, I would probably go with Skillshare because it can bring you in a passive income. If you're good at photos and you know videos, then Shutterstock is a great option for you. But ultimately, any anything that's passive, anything where you do the work once and upload it and earn from that, I'm a huge fan of it. So yeah, look, that is today's video. If you've got any comments or questions, leave them down below. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>